The subway structure is a concrete railway viaduct completed in 1915. This structure was built to eliminate a dangerous multi-track level crossing that was responsible for countless accidents and even some fatalities. Although the general manager of the Canadian government railways, G. P. Glutilius, and concerned citizens such as Captain Masters fought for the subway to be built, the final decision would only be made after Moncton's first plebiscite. Voters opted for the subway. The height of the structure was appropriate at the time of construction for vehicle traffic, including an electric tramway system. Today, larger transport trucks and boom trucks invariably get stuck at least once a year. This usually involves deflating the truck's tires to free it. Being a railway hub for the Maritimes, Moncton hosted annual Railroad Days celebrations. Students would be selected to paint murals on the interior wall panels of the structure, while most of Main Street was blocked off for festival activities. From the 1970s until the 1980s, the subway structure was actually painted bright pink. This structure still stands as a monument to the former glory days of the railway industry in Moncton.